going on guys? It's your boy Ant. God made 32 on Instagram. And today we back with another reaction, man. And today we got something real special. We got the prologue for Jurassic World Domination. And I can't wait to get in there. I think we all know how widespread the love for the Jurassic Park franchise goes. Uh, I think we all know the nostalgia that it brings when we watch a Jurassic Park film. While these newer Jurassic World film has their own style and their own fan base, I think the thing that really gels the two together is just the creativeness and the way how they use dinosaurs, man. It's having them up there, uh, getting these stories again, putting people in the world of dinosaurs. This time around, it gives them the ultimate chance to 100% cut loose. All of the other films have been combined into an island of some sort, some sort of confined space. And now most of these dinosaurs are just out there in the wilderness. And I can't wait to definitely see how they pull this off. If you like what you see here, please remember to like and subscribe. It helps us way more than you know. And it helps us beat the YouTube algorithm. We on the road to 1,000 subscribers. So every subscriber matters. And without any further ado, we got the first five minutes of Jurassic World. Let's. Here we go, man. We back into the world. A Comcast company. Oh, snap. Okay, to be continued, this theater's a summer. Lovely. But yeah, guys, that was the first five minutes of Jurassic World Domination, man. And that just looks so awesome. And, you know, starting in the prehistoric times, giving us a whole two, three minute just sitting with them. Seeing how they lived their lives, seeing what they was doing at that point. And, you know, at that time, because of the way how the last movie left off, I didn't know if it was, oh, we're seeing what had happened. They're jumping in the future and seeing what had happened since they had last gotten out. But no, it was showing us in the past of when they actually had the planet and what they might do since they're back out here again. Hey, I just like that just now, man. That just looked amazing, man. I like how scared everybody looked. And it would be, uh, it's going to be nuts, like, having them around the general population. Because all of the Jurassic Park movies, the dinosaurs have only been around scientists or wranglers or militiamen. So, like, just having them around, like, general population is going to be amazing, man. Uh, we've seen people just getting hit by cars. We've seen people running over. We've seen people leaving their children. It's it's going to be total mayhem. It's going to be just like when uh, the dinosaurs got unleashed in the park in the original Jurassic World, in a brand new Jurassic World movie. And, it's it, yeah, it's just going to be that tenfold, you know what I mean, uh, on, a, on a very wide scale. And I can't wait to see that in theaters, man. But, yeah, guys, jump down in the comments and let me know what you think, man. Are you excited about this movie? Have you been a fan of the Jurassic Park series and or the Jurassic World series? How many of the movies you've been watching? For the animal lovers out there, what's your favorite dinosaur? And what ha and what's your favorite dinosaur that they have shown so far in the Jurassic Park series? And who's your favorite character in all of the Jurassic Park movies? C Chris Pratt has been a, a pretty decent new protagonist. But, uh, uh, um, uh, uh, I got my favorite character. Wink! But if you like what you see here, please remember to like and subscribe. It helps us way more than you know, and it helps us beat the YouTube algorithm. And if you want to be notified when we upload new videos, go ahead and click that little bell icon. Thank you. Wow. 